Another game that our kids really love doing, or playing rather, is our dummy relay races. Now again, our kids and our parents think, well, geez, all they're doing is going out there having a good time, but that isn't the case. What I'm doing is determining who's got core strength uh, when doing these games. And by the way, when we do the deer hunter, or if we do the, the, uh, uh, the dummy relay races, our kids are jumping around and yelling and screaming and just having a great time. What we do here is we set a pylon here and another pylon maybe about 12 yards away, 12 to 14 yards. It really depends on the age of your kids. So 12 to 14 yards for, for uh, you know, 10-year-old kids, 10 or 11-year-old kids, you go further or shorter based on the age of your children. What we do is we divide the groups up into, into four teams. Um, four teams. There's you know, team one, team two, team three, team four. Each, we have the same number of kids in each line. Obviously, you have to be even it out. Somebody needs to go twice, you do it. But basically, what we do is, is we have a player in the first row hold up the big, tall stand-up dummy, okay? The big, tall one. And what we, what we do is he's holding the dummy, and he runs it around the pylon. He runs around the pylon, comes and gives it to his partner. His partner is waiting, and it's a relay race. So he starts here, goes around, gives it to his partner. He goes around, goes, gives it to his partner, and he goes around. And what happens is, is that all the teams that lose, the teams that don't finish in first place, they will have to do like five push-ups, something really uh, simple, but something that, that gives an incentive for the kids to win. So they're all yelling and cheering for each other. Now what this does is this, is we really can determine from this, which kids have great core strength, okay? So if a kid is holding that tall dummy up, and he's you know, going from side to side, he can't really hold it, he doesn't have good core strength. I mean, you've got kids that look like Tarzan and play like Jane, and we have really big kids that, that have no core strength. On the other hand, you'll have that skinny, wiry little kid who doesn't look like much of a football player, and guess what? He grabs that dummy, he runs right straight down there and right straight back, and guess what? He's going to be a stud football player, and you need to put him in a situation or a position that requires athleticism. And you can determine that very easily just by watching how well those kids carry those dummies during the dummy relay race. And again, you're gonna have the kids are gonna have a blast doing it. The next drill that, that I like